Sometimes fame is Tony pedestal. If discovered, signed, and flagged up there by prominent record labels. A slow killing poison. At first they pretend they value your potential after evaluating pros and cons of investing in you, the industry products, not the gifted, authentic, legit artist deserving genuine treatment into greatness stardom. In business, it's time calculating losses and profits so from ghetto to high speed, flashy rise, next superstar, take over marketing, up there you are, effortlessly without engaging in that most important growth process, it's once in a lifetime, joyous dreams coming true, being idolized by masses, wowed by your struggles, drags to riches, story, obviously inspiring new uprising generation thinking your level of success is rightfully deserved yet within you truth is you own nothing everything earned from music streams and royalties high-end sold out shows and tours plus six figures endorsement deals <laughs> worst is you don't own masters to your own productivity all compensating for the signatures you signed without lawyers that translates contracts to protesting justice. Then you are dropped back to zero, grazing depression alone after short-lived glamour. It's pain in the ass seeing another goes up and abuse strategies continues. Double on some.